Boom shakalaka, the last time Bitcoin did this, the price went up on average 867%. Stay tuned. What's up everyone, Randall here from Crypto Love. Today's video, we're taking a look at a lot of very interesting charts for Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies, including the last time Bitcoin did this, the price went up 867%. Before we get into it, make sure to like, subscribe, click the notification bell, come join us on Twitter at the Crypto Love. Push that like button today. Fear at 29, same as we were yesterday, the overall market sideways from yesterday bitcoin at 16797 ethereum at 1207 bnb at 247 xrp 34 cents dogecoin 7 cents cardano 25 cents and polygon 79 cents bitcoin right now within this larger descending wedge structure we have a bit of a wedge forming here we were rejected it from previous june lows this pink line right here and right now struggling because we are underneath the 20 day moving averages orange line now, if we take a look at the grander scheme of markets, the bullish divergence is setting the stage for a big run. Total, flood fun, total funds flowing into the market made a higher low with S&P 500 making a lower low. It last happened during the 2008 bottom. We all know the rally that followed. That's right. There were higher lows down here with the five period moving average. There were lower lows with the price massive rally followed we're seeing this again higher lows with the five period moving average lower lows with the price potentially setting up for a massive massive run not only that but insider selling is getting exhausted the insiders have pretty much sold all that they could the last time we saw insider selling pressure lows like we're seeing right now especially with this turnaround that we see right here these were right before very pivotal parts large rallies like in 2011. Now, those are the broader markets in terms of Bitcoin on the monthly charts. We can see each time Bitcoin died, price action descended into a bullish falling wedge, which we saw back here in 2011, 2015, most recently. Well, more importantly, the repetitive cycle is a monthly RSI. Each bottom that's RSI hit less than one. We can see right here, hitting this lower line, hitting the lower line, hitting the lower line. Guess where we hit last month? That's right, the same line, less than one, with the same falling wedge. Could we be set for a breakout? Well, if that's not enough proof for you, how about taking a look at the ADX? This recently has hit levels it hit only in the 2015 bottoms, simultaneously hitting again right now. Could this again be the lows forming for Bitcoin? Well, we have this other chart, the Bitcoin ellipse. Now, if we take a look at this, happened in 2015, 2019, again, happening right now, where basically Bitcoin completes one ellipse and then onto another ellipse. Bitcoin is repeating this pattern over and over. It's reached the final few candles within the present ellipse. It will go to the next one with parabolic move very soon. So as you can see, we have an ellipse and it touches the top. Basically, the ellipse, same on the bottom, touches the bottom. And then eventually it breaks out and above that ellipse for a parabolic run. Now, same thing happened here in 2018. Touches the top, same rise to the bottom of that ellipse before breaking out for a parabolic run. Now, we have the top of that ellipse right up here. We have the bottom of the ellipse where we are riding on right now. This would suggest that we would continue to ride that ellipse up above $20,000 before breaking out for a parabolic run run which brings us to this chart very bullish chart for bitcoin the last time bitcoin did this and went up 67 percent but on average this has done this six times previously on average goes up 860 plus percent this is the two week macd cross we can see this right here we had it confirmed in 2022 in the history of bitcoin here's what happened after the cross back in 2013 went up 1,235%. In 2015, went up 255%. In 2016, went up 2,766%. In 2019, 241%. 2020, 641%. And 2021, went up 67%. So that being said, potentially being posed for a massive rally in Bitcoin price, or at the very least, the lowest one was 67%. So things are looking good for Bitcoin despite the overall general market pessimism. That's all for today's video. If you enjoyed it, push that like button. I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Love you. Peace. If you don't think Bitcoin's going to a million dollars a coin and then $10 million a coin, you're already a loser. <laughs>